Gus that president. Gus that president. Gus that president. You never know who will be president one day. Here are some stories of kids who grew up to become president. Can you guess which president which each story is about? Nature lover. He was often sick as a boy and could not go to school. He was thought tough at home. He made himself strong by playing outside the house and boxing. When he grew up, Teddy Roosevelt still loved the outdoor life. He hunted and fished. He took long hikes. He went to new places. Gold miner. This boy's parents had both died at bo by the time he was nine. He worked in gold mines as a young man. He became rich from his work before he turned 40. Herbert Hoover did not take any money for being president. He gave the money to help others. Island Jeweler This president loved in lived in Hawaii when he was a child. He loved basketball and comic books. He likes to draw pictures of his favorite hero, Superman, Spider-Man. Barack Obama still played basketball. Even after he became president, he was the first black president of the United States. He won a special award for helping countries work together to solve problems. Work Traveler this boy spent many years growing up outside the United States. When he was only 14, he, want, he went to Russia on a job for the, U, the U.S. government. John Quincy Adams worked for the government his whole life. He was the son of others, other U.S. President John Adams. Horse trainer. When he was only nine, farms, farmers paid him to train their horses. He set a horse jumping record at the at his uh, college. Ulysses S. Grant was a famous general in the army before he became president. When he was a young man, he wanted to be a math teacher. Do you know the President of the United States must be at least uh, 35 years old? The youngest person to become President was Theodore Roosevelt at age 42.